What is going on guys? It's Wav here. Welcome back to some more Blightfall. It's been a couple weeks since I've had a episode and uh, I, I've been kind of busy doing some other stuff. Uh, I was doing some off-camera work for uh, for Blightfall and stuff and then uh, I was kind of busy this week as well so I didn't get an episode up on like Tuesday or whatever but anyways we're finally back with some more uh, Blightfall. As you can see I'm doing some stuff over here with the, the what's a centrifuge? Yeah the uh, alchemical centrifuge turning the Victus over here into uh, Aqua and Terra inside of the, uh, the ward of jars or whatever and I'm just kind of throwing those over here into the crystallizers and uh, getting them into uh, crystal form and whatnot. I made a couple more of these uh, essential reservoirs, which I think we made last episode. And uh, oh, I, I started using these these labels over here. I started making these. They're they're actually kind of cheap, and I started using them for specifically for the uh, the essential that I'm going to be using for the Dawn Machine. You can see I have a chest over here specifically for Dawn Machine Essential, which is that machine that's on the ship. I don't know. I think it's like somewhere over there where uh, that I'm basically using to clean up the whole entire world. So uh, let me see where is the ship at. At where I leave it this time. Uh, oh, yeah, there's a little bit of must be a tainted note or something over there. I need to go clean up on my own, but uh, I don't know where I, I don't know where I left the ship. It's like completely gone. That was like over here somewhere, wasn't it? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I guess I guess I'll have to figure this out here in the future. Actually, I think it's is it over here, maybe up here. Yeah, I have no idea where I left it. <laughs> I'm going to have to look at the map a little bit more closely here in the future. Anyways, making a, having, a, having a special chest over here for the Essentia. And the cool thing about the little labels is that uh, on here we have a Spiritus label. So only Spiritus will go inside of this jar. Like uh, Ignis and all that other stuff that I might have over here will not go into that jar. Only Spiritus if I have it. And since we have these things get that can hold uh, 256 of any Essentia, uh, we have a pretty good well, for lack of a better term, pretty good reservoir over here for storing our Essentia and stuff. And using these specific board jars with the labels on them to grab the specific Essentia that we want. Like over here we have a lot of Herba, uh, Berdicio, Ignis. I think we have, yeah, we have some Arbor, Air. I think we yeah, Machina. And we got a little bit of Sano, just a little bit. Going to need to get some more milk and stuff if we'll want to get that. But uh, as you can see, we're getting a pretty good amount of progress. And uh, I think the main stuff that takes a lot of Essentia is the Air. The Ignis takes a little bit, and the Machina takes a lot of it, so we're definitely going to need a lot of that stuff. Whenever I'm doing some, uh, some, some, I guess, off-camera tank cleaning, because that always takes forever to do. But, uh, with the new, uh, whatever that thing is called over here, the Advanced Alchemical Furnace, we're getting an absolute ton of Essentia without having to, like, you know, smelt it in the Alchemical Alembics and whatnot, and putting it inside of the jars. We just have this little setup over here, and I'm, I'm, I'm liking it quite nicely, to be quite honest. I'm, I'm really liking it. Anyways, uh, I guess since this is done centrifuging into the uh, Aqua and the Terra, we can just throw it over here and get those to turn into the crystal forms. So as you can see, we're crystallizing the Terra and whatnot. Looks like our great wood trees over here started growing, so that is good. We have one, two, three, four of these bad boys, so that is not... I thought we planted enough for like five. I guess we only planted four of them. Hmm. Okay, well, not complaining. We only had one of uh, one of these great wood trees beforehand, so now we have four. That's definitely really good. Anyways, let's go to sleep. I, I had an idea for us to, to potentially go back to that one area. Uh, I forgot what it was called, but that one dimension with all the mobs and stuff inside of it, like the Eldritch Crabs, the Eldritch Dimension, whatever the hell it's called. I want to set up like some sort of mob farm over there. You guys remember, I think, in the Desert Oasis, what was it, uh... It was Binom something, uh, Epsilon, I think, maybe Gamma? No, 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 it's not Gamma. Omega, maybe? Is this the one that, no, this is the one that's underwater. Epsilon? Is this the one that's in the desert? Oh, Jesus, a tainted chicken. Gee, whoo, let's send in that tainted tendril so we do not get tainted. Let's go to the xenobiologist and ba-boom, hater, nice. <laughs> Anyways, I think we have some of our golems over here, so, oh, I need to get the, uh, do I, have the bell? I think we have the bell in our backpack, right? I think we already have, a, have it in the... Oh, yeah, there it is right there. The Golemensis bell. All right, let's grab uh, all of our golems over here. And I, I kind of want to set them up to be oh, to be uh, in the Eldritch dimension. So you kill a bunch of the Eldritch mobs. Now, how do I do this? Uh, is that it? I think I did. Oh, okay, I think that's how you pick them up, right? Uh, yeah, he has iron plate. Oh, oh, I'm getting killed by a skeleton fella. Oof, there we go. Uh, we should have a lot of bones in here, right? Nah, yeah, 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 it doesn't have any bones inside of it. Because it doesn't even, uh, 
It doesn't, it doesn't load these chunks whenever I'm not over here, unfortunately. Even with the, uh, the chunk loader that we moved over here. Which is really unfortunate, but I guess what I could do is, uh, build a safe area inside the Eldritch Dimension. Let's get a bunch of, uh, I guess cobblestone or something, right? Let's see, uh, cobble. Gobble to gobble, let's grab some of the cobblestone. Uh, ba boom And we can build, uh, a little wall area. Wall it off. Make it safe for us, and uh, we can place the golems down. Uh, of course, there's going to be two golems that are going to be killing the actual spiders themselves, or the little crabs, I guess they're technically called. <laughs> and then, of course, one of the golems is going to be uh, harv or picking up the picking up the loot and whatnot. Oh, whoa! Is it because I teleported that this uh, is it loading in and whatnot? Uh, yeah, that has a lot of that has enough ignis and stuff. Is this? I don't think it's working. Hmm. Let me, let me check this real quick. Is this charging up? Is this charging up my wand? Uh, my wand doesn't need charging up. This doesn't need charging up either. Hmm. Okay, that still has a fire. So I can only assume that still works. Is it, can I can I throw something inside there? No. Uh, I guess we can throw a little bit of cobble, right? Yeah, it seems like it's still... Okay, it might just be a graphical glitch. Because this is uh, smelting the cobblestone pretty well, to be quite honest. Seems like it's, uh, is that connected? That's not connected up. Actually, is that even smelling the cobblestone? Or, like, liquefying it or whatever? Oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah I guess it smelled like five of it. Is there any, uh... Yeah, there's no terra over here. It must be inside of the pipes, then. Hmm, let's see. Is there any terra over here? I don't think we need terra. Yeah, we oh, wait. Yeah, there's some terra there. Uh, Volatis. Yeah, that's just the feather stuff from the, uh, from the feathers I threw inside there to get some of the air. Is there a terra inside of here? Oh yeah, there is! Huh, what do you know? I guess I'm gonna have to throw that somewhere else. Hmm, oh no, yeah, it's... There's no more fire there. Huh. I wonder why this isn't working right now. If I break this and then put it back, is that gonna fix it? If we're gonna have this problem every time I teleport, it's gonna be kind of, uh, kind of troublesome. Is that gonna work better? Um... Man, this guy dumb. Let's see, where am I placing it? I'm placing it, like, right there, right? I think. Okay, let's break this, and then place it back down. Come on, please. Oh! I think it's working. Oh, it's working, you guys! Okay. Huh. I wonder why it wasn't... Yeah, there we go. And I assume it's getting the, getting the Ignis. It's going to get the flame little texture inside there, hopefully soon. Hmm. That's really interesting. That's, that's kind of unfortunate that the, uh... Every time we teleport out here, I guess, get out of the load of chunks... That that happens. I wonder, do we still have the chunk loader? Do we still have the chunk? Oh yeah, we do. I guess we can get the chunk loader and I suppose we can keep these chunks loaded and whatnot. You know, it is called a chunk loader after all. And uh, let's see if it, uh, show lasers. Yeah, how big is the range? Yeah, let's make it a little bit bigger. Two, three, four chunks. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's good. That's a pretty good, uh, pretty good radius. Honestly, that's a little bit too much if I'll be a little bit honest here. Let's move it, uh, how about, how about we move it over here, huh? Mm, yeah, about right here. That seems pretty good. Show lasers. How big is that? Okay, so it goes, oh, okay, let's go to three chunks. Three chunks, or, or uh, I guess 25 chunks. The three chunk radius. Uh, okay, yeah, that goes all the way out there. That looks like it just goes right, just beyond the thing, right? Or is it, oh yeah. Look at that, it's like right at, that's actually perfect. All right, I don't think we need it to be any bigger than that. We go, ah, let's make it one more bigger. Just cause I think one of our aura nodes might be able to recharge some of its stuff while we're gone if we keep that like that, right? Uh, how far does that go out to? Uh, yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> Not bad. All right, well, let's uh, hide lasers. Let's, let's keep that as is. I guess what we could do is uh, teleport somewhere. Let's teleport back to whatever other biodomes, I suppose, and <laughs> teleport back here and see if that area is still loaded in. See if it does that little glitch again with the uh, with the with the little laser things. No, look at that. <laughs> They're still loaded in. Perfect. All right. So I guess that's finally a use for that chunk loader over there. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Still loaded in the ignis over here, so that's good. All right. Well, anyways, without any further ado. Ah, uh, I'm thinking here. Should I get a third golem that's going to be able to attack things? Do I have enough, uh, what are they called? Thaumamium. Do I have enough Thaumamium? I feel like I made a- No, 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 I made flesh golems, didn't I? 
Yeah, I made like a thousand flesh golems because <laughs> they got up my, uh, my, my warp and whatnot, which is going to warp. If we're going to be heading to the Eldritch Dimension, we might as well get that warp warp from over here, right? Just to keep us nice and safe from the spooky evils of the Illuminati. <laughs> Anyways, let's go back down. And, uh, I guess we can read our book. Where do the flesh golems... Oh, that's the wrong book. Uh, Thom Thomonomicon. There you go. Where do the flesh golems rank? Uh, golem, let's see. Where is that at? There it is right there. Where do they rank, uh, compared to iron golems, stone golems, clay golems, flesh golems. There it is right there. Um, low durability, low strength, very fast self-repair, carry limits four, speeds of a vavage. Hmm, compared to the Thomium uh, Golems that have a high durability, very high durability, high strength, self-repair is slow, but, you know, if they have pretty good durability, then, eh, plus the iron armor that I gave them, it shouldn't really be that big of a deal. 32 carry limit, man, that's insane. <laughs> Speed isn't really that big of a deal, since they're going to be uh, enclosed in a pretty small area, so, how much uh, Thomium, how do you make them again? Okay, yeah, we're going to need 8 Humanus, 8 Modus, and 8 Spiritus. Uh, we have a pretty good amount of those, and... We just need a Thaumomium block, which is nine Thaumom- or Thaumium ingots. What, what is the difference between Thaumomium and Thaumium? Is, uh, I don't know. I guess we'll figure it out later, but we have five Thaumium ingots. I suppose we can make a third one here in the future if if the, if the golems, like, continually die and whatnot. I hope- I hope not, but let's- let's go over to the, uh... Man, where is it? What was it called? It's been a little while since I played, as you guys know. Uh... Obelisk guy. There you go. Let's go there. I think it's it. Yeah, 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 over here, because it has the obelisk, of course. <laughs> Let's go inside the portal. And I suppose what we can do is, uh, oh man, we're getting attacked right off the bat. Man, this guy is already attacking us. Uh, 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 there you go. Uh, okay, whew, we got that guy. Let's see. Let's look at the mini map. Where is the nearest? Okay, the nearest, nearest nest, I guess you can call. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, whoops, I accidentally went through the portal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, can I get through the portal again? I know it, like, sometimes it glitches and stuff. And whenever I go through the portal, it doesn't let me go through for, like, a couple seconds and whatnot. Get? Okay, let me let me teleport back to my base. I literally teleported to another dimension. I guess we continue to myth bust this. Yeah, but look at that. It's still connected up. Still looks like it's working fine. Perfect. Man, I love that. I, I love how we finally have a use for that chunk loader. You guys don't know how, how sour I was. We spent like a whole episode, maybe two episodes, trying to make that thing, and then we just store it inside of the ME terminal and never use it again. I'm so glad that we're finally using it for an actual cause, you know? Because I know the goals weren't able to, to work with that chunk loader, but now with the, the things working, it finally has a proper use. Anyways, let's get our uh, cobblestone down in our inventory, and let's, let's fence this area off over here. Okay, there they are right there. Okay, we should probably kill the edge. Get, get rid of the crow. Oh, he's on my head. Ooh, man, we need to start killing these things. Oh, man, yeah. We're going to get so many ender pearls once we... Oh, no, there's one of the guardians. There's one of the guardians. Oh, man, we're losing some health. We're losing some health. Uh, not really, though. You can't really physically see it on the health bar down there. Man, look at all these guys. I'm almost confident our goals would really have a hard time with these guys. Actually, you know what? Hmm. If we do wall there... Oh, is there a guy on my... I thought there was a guy in my head because I was constantly getting attacked right there. Jeez! Alright, let's do this. Fence them off. I know they could probably climb on the ceilings and whatnot, but... Whew! What if I did a little strategy where I basically completely fence them off just like this? And then just open up a, a little a little window for me to, to break... To, to, to attack them like this? Can they fit through this? Get over here, you nasty looking things. Can you guys fit through that? Uh, I don't... I don't think so. Uh, oh, 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 yes I can, yes I can. Okay, we might want to get the, uh, what is it called? What is it called? A constant wall and put it, like, right there. That way they can't physically, uh, go through it. I guess? Hmm. I guess what we could do is break the cobblestone wall whenever we want to go inside there and grab the loot and all the ender pearls and all the experience orbs and whatnot. And then, like, just sit here and grind all day and hope nothing comes behind us. So, if... Uh, that's gonna be a possibility. We should probably- Oh! Yep, something just made it through, just like I thought. Okay, whew. Let's do this. Uh, I guess we can get a door. We probably have a lot of doors back home. Let's do that. What do I have on me right now? Warp word? Is that it, really? Is that the thing that's making those particles? I guess so, huh. Okay, well, there you go. And I suppose we could put a door, uh, right there, and then we'll be nice and safe from all, the, like, the Eldritch Guardians that might try and sneak up on us behind us, so that's gonna be kinda cool. Um, do you guys think that's a pretty good strategy? I think it is. Hmm. 
I kind of want to go back home though and make a make a make a make a third. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! He turned into a crab. Oh, jeez, there we go. Whew. I kind of want to go make a third uh, third guy because there, there's swarms and I mean swarms of those guys there. So I really, really, really think that our golems, even though they have a lot of health, they have a lot of they have they have the iron armor on them. They're gonna have the hammers that are going to be. I hope one shot in those bad boys. I I I just don't think that. Two is enough. We might even need to get four to be quantum. Maybe well, let's see how let's see how three goes. If 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 three looks like they're starting to have problems, then I guess we can make a fourth one. But I think whenever they die, they just drop like these little little things like that, right? So maybe the maybe the little collector golem can pick up their <laughs> the fallen brethren and whatnot. <laughs> Anyways, let's uh what do you need to make the Thama or where is it? Oh, there it is right there. What do you need to make the thumb on me? I think you need like, ah, uh, was it? Precontatio and then iron, right? Where in the world would I find? I guess I could just go to Golem and see, go there and then find recipe. There it is right there. Okay, yeah, four Precontatio, one iron ingot. So we have five right now. We need to get four more, which means we need to get 16 Precontatio. I don't know if we have. Uh, oh, yeah, we have enough. We have enough. Uh, I'm hearing a spider though. I should probably go to bed. Where's this spider at? I think he's on the ground. I think he's on the ground. Look at this piece of trash. <laughs> All right, well, let's go to bed. Let's go to bed, make it daytime. That way, I'm like, it is a spider. It's not like it's going to burn in the daytime or anything, but hopefully it won't attack us in the daytime. Because I, I, I don't know. Sometimes spiders will still attack you if they're still aggroed on you, even if it turns to daytime like that. So I'm like, if he's underground, then <laughs> it's not like he's going to attack me in the first place, but better safe than sorry. Anyways, Iron. Uh, oh, whoops. Iron. There you go. Uh, let's grab a one block of iron. There we go. And ba boom. And break it a show. We're gonna need to get one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. There you go. Four thamamium gate. Uh thamamium. Oh, there it is right there. Whoa. I thought it was I didn't even see him. Huh, I'm gonna kill you there, little eight-legged freak. <laughs> Alright, well let's go over here. Let's make the other uh, thamamium uh block. Oh, I have to grab the I want me from the, uh, what's it called? There it is right there. From the ME terminal. Perfect. And then I think we need to get, what is it? Eight Humanus, eight uh, Modus, and eight uh, Cognitio, is it? I don't know. Man, our inventory is pretty full right now. Do we have a, uh, something we could, I guess rotten flesh. Oh, yeah, I have these jar. I guess we could put these up over here. Actually, I'll put it up in the uh, the chest over here. That way I know where they're at. You know, if I'm, I, I might as well keep them where I'm, as well as the extra jars. Yeah, I have 60 of those bad boys. And then a little bit of Spirit's jar right there. And I think we're good. All right. Oh, man. Yeah, we got seven ender pearls from those. I didn't even go inside the area and collect those ender pearls and, and experience things. I need to go back before they despawn. Let's go back there. I don't want all that hard work to go to waste. Let's go to the, what is it called? Obelisk Island. <laughs> yes, you definitely tell that it's been a been a week and a half, two weeks since I played. Jeez, can't even remember the name of the place. Oh, I'm a little bit hungry right now. Need to watch my back. Make sure no creep. Oh man, we got, got to get the dumb doors that I wanted to get. <laughs> All right, let's go back inside there. And uh, I suppose, oh, let's get the, uh, the copstone in our inventory. Just so we can quickly place them back down. Oh man, that's a lot of experience. Oh, and there's the dumb spiders. Oof, there you go. Yeah, we're on the level 34 already. Oh, man, I hate how it doesn't let me fly. I'm like, I already beat the boss. It's not like it really even matters, you know, but pff, whatever. Ah, let's go back through the portal. I thought it was like, uh, Ender Pearl. Maybe the Ender Pearls did despawn. All I got was the experience uh, orbs, but I'm not complaining. <laughs> Anyways, let's go back over there. Uh, let's see how much Humanus and stuff that we have. Uh, I think it's Humanus, Cognitio, and Modus, right? Let's let's just triple, quadruple check. Uh, oh, Spiritus. Oh, it's not Cognitio, it's Spiritus. Um, do I still have Spiritus? Because I should have a lot of Spiritus because I've... Tell them. Because I... Oh, yeah, I've got a lot of Spiritus. <laughs> no problem. Because I threw a lot of... Uh, rot I think, yeah, Rotten Flesh inside the, the Crystallizers. So that's how I have a, a lot of Spiritus. I have Alienus there, too. Oh, yeah, perfect. Uh, I think we get Alienus from the Ender Pearls, which we can definitely use to make more of those... Uh, these these reservoirs over here. So that's definitely good. Uh, what I need? Modus. Yeah, yeah, let's see. Uh, double click. Motus. Oh, wait. Motus. Yeah, no modus in there, it seems. No modus in there. Ooh, there we go. Modus. Uh, we need eight of that. So we have Spiritus, Modus, and what was the other one? Humanus. Okay. That might be the one we're missing. 
But uh, oh no 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 no! There we go. We've got it. Hey, da, one two. We might be able to make the uh, the third and or uh, the fourth golem, to be quite honest. So, anyways, without any further ado, let's throw the ingredients, sugar, spice, and everything nice. Get ourselves the fourth golem fellow. He's completely naked right now. Um, we still need to give him the gather core, iron plating, and an air upgrade. Which I don't know what the air upgrade is. Is that speed? Or something? I don't know. If I gave him the air upgrade, then I guess that's for a real- I guess I can look at the Thaumonopcon, right? Where's that at? Uh, order. Where's that? Oh, whoops. That's the wrong thing. Oh, there it is right there. Air. Uh, it will increase its movement and ranged attack speed. Ooh, okay, so it attacks faster. Perfect. That's actually a good, uh, good reason. Is there anything that makes it do dim- uh, do more a damage? Golems fitted with this upgrade automatically inflicts damage on anything damaging them. Ooh. Uh, I don't think we have- can we put multiple uh, upgrades on these golems? I think I think they let the Thaumium ones have yeah two upgrades. Okay, and the current ones have just one, right? Yeah, just uh, I don't know if the iron plating counts as an upgrade, but we could probably give them an air and an entropy upgrade, right? Uh, let's look at the other ones. Order uh, allows them greater control. Uh, yeah, I don't think that really matters. We don't need that for them. Water. Uh, increases visual range, fire, uh, increases interface inventory, huh, don't really need that, honestly, earth, that increases the amount of iron so you can carry, wait, what, wait, what's the difference between fire and, uh, this column increases the interface inventory, over here. oh, the interface, oh, okay, yeah, they're completely different, they're not, like, carry weight, this is, like, interface inventory, kind of like over here at the, uh, with these golems, isn't there, yeah, one of these is Thaumium, actually, yeah, uh, one of, oh, <laughs> he's got the, Oh, no, 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 I thought I gave them glasses. I just look like they're wearing glasses. Oh, yeah, this guy does have two upgrades. Nice. Uh, looks like he does have the earth and the air. Cool. Okay, I guess we can get the entropy upgrade. Uh, I'll, I'll get the iron plating and stuff. How do you make the iron plating again? It is, uh... Oh, the iron hammer and the iron plating. We're gonna need an uh, iron chest plate. And then some iron. So let's do that. Iron. Uh, looks like we don't have an iron chest plate, so let's grab a little bit of iron right there. I know we have a lot of iron in our inventory already, but... We're gonna need to make an actual full-on chest plate. And then I think uh do this, right? Yep, there it is right there. There's the accessory upgrade, and then make a hammer for him too. There you go. So now he has a weapon. Now he has some armor for protection. Uh try to remember how do you I think you need a shard, right? Like the uh yeah, an air shard surrounded by gold. Okay, that's easy. And then an entropy shard surrounded by gold. That's easy too. Alright. Let's look for shard. Air shard. And entropy shard, perfect. I think we got it, you guys. Um, let's see. What am I looking for now? Oh yeah, gold, gold nuggets. Uh, I guess we don't have any gold nuggets, so let's grab a uh, two ingots here. Turn those into nugget arrows. And ba boom, and then surround the shard like so, and get their proper upgrade. Perfect. I love it. Easy, no problem. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Did I really just say squeezy? <laughs> Anyways, let's put up the uh, the stuff we don't need. Clear our inventory a little bit more. And I guess we've got it, you guys. Let's, let's throw this guy down on the ground. Oh, yeah, we should probably get the uh, more entropy upgrades for the other ones, right? So, entropy shard. So, one, two. So, we're going to have three of them attacking. Gold. We should probably get two more things of gold. Get more nuggets, right? More nugget arrows. And, oh, ba boom. There you go. Make two more entropy upgrades. Baboom, got it. All three of them. Perfect. And let's upgrade them here. That way I won't have to worry about them there. Uh, yep, that's the iron plating. That's the... Oh, all of them have iron plate. Oh, okay, that's the guard one, guard one. Oh, gather is the one that picks the stuff up. We need to get the guard cord. Okay, so let's get the guard core here in a second. Uh, let's place these guys down. Give them their proper upgrades. There we go. Uh, that one's completely naked. There we go. Uh, let's give him his upgrades. I'm going to need to give him this command here in a second, too. Now, can I give this guy a... It looks like a can. Yep, perfect. Nice. <laughs> All right, so now they have the entropy upgrade. This guy has the air and entropy upgrade. Perfect. Let's give him the hammer and the thing. And then we can give him a... Ah, uh, what was that called again? Guard. Ooh, he has, like, no health. Oh, no, 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 no. I think he has to regen it, right? Because he... Did he get more health from the thing? Uh, where's my... Oh, no. Did I put it up somewhere? <laughs> Where'd it go? It's gone! Uh, I, I guess I put it up. I don't know why I put it up. <laughs> did you guys see me put it up? I don't remember it. Advanced goals. Did I... 
Wait, what? Huh. Well, at least I have the warp ward. I guess I never... That is advanced golem thing. Hmm. Okay, well, let's see. We should probably... Uh, oh, put that up there, I suppose. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll worry about that later. Yeah, I'll worry about that later. Uh, right now, what we need to do is the gather upgrade... Or a uh, guard upgrade. Or to gather... Or guard core. God, I can't speak English. <laughs> Where's the guard one at? Sorting fill. Use empty. Gather. Oh, there's there, our there, guard. Okay, so I'm going to get the golem animation core with the uh, vinculium. And what is that called? Vinculum. Okay. And tell them. So we need five and five. And then the empty animation core, which we probably have a few. Yep, we have an empty one right there. That's a butcher one right there. Uh, vinculum. I don't know if we. I'll have to check, I guess. Vinculium. Uh, that's. F oh, wait. There, yeah, there's right there. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. And then we need a. Uh, Tell him right. Tell. Oh, there it is, right there. One, two, three, four, five. All right, guys. I, th I thought I might have to pause the recording and see if we can find these 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 things, but I guess not. Mm. All right, let's throw these ingredients inside there. Empty animation cord, and ba boom, you've got it. Hey, da. Let's grab the uh the thing. Go on, message bell. Grab you. Pick you up. All right, so we have all three of the golems now, or well, all four of them, including the one that's going to be picking stuff up. Uh, let's do that. There we go. All right, so I guess we can go over there now. Uh, we should probably get a chest and a door. Uh, perfect. Uh, let's get a double chest, just in case we get so many items. I'm, I'm getting a little bit ahead of myself here, but what are you going to do, right? Uh, and a door. There you go. Let's get a, uh... I guess I could just get... Yeah, let's get two doors. I don't know if these, these spiders can casually open doors and whatnot, but... Let's do it, hey da! Alright, well, let's go over to the other dimension. Place down these, these, these golem fellows. And I suppose just let them do their job. Uh, let's see, where am I going here? Oh, let's go. There you go. Let's go over there. To Obelisk Island. Diddly doodly diddly do. Let's go through the Obelisk Portal. Or what's it called again? Eldritch Portal. Yep. Alright, look. Oh, oh, there's a fellow. There's a fellow shambling husk. He's going to turn into a crab. Oh, there he is right there. There you go. Oh, he's on my head. I guess not. Okay, we got him. <laughs> Alright, let's go over to the area. Let's put, uh, place down those two doors. That way we're nice and safe. And we could hopefully peacefully place down our golem friends let's do this there you go and i suppose do the same thing over on yeah uh let's do this there you go all right Whew. all right oh man okay hmm i'm thinking here do i have a crap i don't think i have a crap damn in my inventory i kind of want to put an empty hole right there empty hole right there and then cobblestone wall cobblestone wall that way they can't jump through it but at the same time, I can go through the door. Oh, I can go through the door if I want, and I can attack him through here if I want. That's. Let's go back home. Yeah, that's definitely something I I want to do. I don't know why I didn't do it. I guess I forgot whenever I was back home. Anyways, let's head back. We need to need to eat a little bit of food here in a second as well. And uh, once we finally have this area set up, I can just go basically AFK, AFK inside that uh, that safe little room uh, I set up inside there. Let all the golems kill everyone. Hopefully come back to like thousands of ender pearls. And uh... Let's see. Wall. Couple some wall. Oh, we only have one. I can make a couple more right here. Right? Six of them. Yeah, six of them at a time. Perfect. Let's grab those bad boys. We only need two of them. So, there you go. Alright, so... I think we're good. Let's eat a little bit of food so we don't, you know, starve and die. <laughs> and hopefully we can uh, harvest... Or, what am I saying? Harvest some health? <laughs> Regenerate some health. Set back to the not bad on beta. Set back to the obelisk island. See, I'm, I'm getting the hang of it again. I'm definitely getting the hang of it again. <laughs> Alright, head back. Oh, spell. Saw a skeleton there for a second before I came through the portal. Oh, there you go. Oh, he's a spinner crab fellow. Oh, there you go. Alright. We can't get a pretty good amount of, uh... Ender pearls from these. I, I can't complain to be quite honest. I'm loving these ender pearls. They're giving us a lot of alienness. And I think they give us something else as well. I forgot. Hmm. All right. Well, let's place down the... There you go. Cobblestone walls. And because the cobblestone walls count as technically 1.5 blocks tall, they can't go through it, right? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. They can still attack through if I get too close, I suppose. Kind of like whenever I almost got killed... Except, oh, whoa, there's like a slit, like, right there. Oh, that is so OP. You guys. We've got a strategy. We might even... Yeah, I, I think these golems are definitely going to help out. I was about to say, like, we might not even need these golems. I could just sit here and just kill them for days like a grinder. That would be fan fiddle but look at this. This is awesome. All right, well, hmm. I was about to say, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, we only brought two of those cobblestone walls, though. Man, probably should have brought a crafting table, to be quite honest. <laughs> that would have been, uh, that would have been really, yeah, I don't have a, I should probably keep a crafting table inside here. Did I put up, I must put my thumb and arm kind of my backpack. Ah, uh, well, whatever. Let's grab these little fellows and kill them. Grab their little eldritch and the pearls and whatnot. Oh my god, there's like 15 of them just spawning right there. Did you guys see that? Gee, man, you better can't get them whenever they're like in the door like that, like directly behind the door. Oh, there you go, got them. Nice, okay. We're gonna need to go in there. It's here in a second. Grab our ender pearls. Grab our loot. Oh my god, look at all those <laughs> experience orbs. Jeez. Man, that's just nonsense. Look at all of them. Man. Oh, whoa, whoa, that's like it. Whoa, what was that? Bold out just crab. Ooh. Okay, yeah. Hopefully our goals don't have any trouble against all these guys. But man, we're doing an absolutely insane job against them. Man. I'm not even using my advantage to my advantage. That was kind of weird to say, but <laughs> still the truth. There was one on my head right there. Oh man, look at that, I'm not even down to my original health bar just yet. There's just so many of these guys. Jeez, man. Oh, we don't, oh, jeez, there's like 50,000 of them. Holy, holy. <laughs> man, I'm loving this already. Okay, I'm gonna need to set up my golems here in a second. Uh, hopefully I can set them from behind the door, though. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, there's a, oh, whew, yeah, there's a lot on my head. I thought there was like, is there another one on my head? I don't think there is. Okay, I think I'm safe right now. Oh man, they got to my they got to my other health bar. I'm getting I'm getting pretty low. I'm getting pretty low. You guys, I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! No, 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 no! <laughs> I got too cocky! I got too cocky to be quite honest. Man, I just got over flooded there. I hope our golems are going to be able to kill them. Jeez, that's just insane. They have their work cut out for them. <laughs> Oh man, that's just crazy. Yeah, it looks like our, our 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 little setup over there is still working. Anyways, let's go back. Let's let's go play some down. Hopefully, from the other side of the thing. Uh, as you as you saw, I just grabbed some more cobblestone walls. So hopefully, we'll be able to make this area a little bit more uh, to our advantage. With the uh, the advantage of the cobblestone walls being like 1.5 blocks and whatnot, they can't like travel through them. And because the cobblestone walls are thicker than or thinner than regular blocks, it gives me that little slit as you guys saw for me to work with. And hopefully, come on, let's shut the door. Shut the door. Shut the door. We have to shut the door, man. Okay, we're we're, we're basically driving them right there. Actually, yeah. Can they not go through the? Oh yeah, they can go through the door. Is there one on my? Yeah, there is one on my head. Jeez. Is there still? Jeez, there's still one on my head. Man, I'm almost dead again! Gee! Man, this... Holy, these guys are... Oh my god, I think my... Oh yeah! It is broken! My my obsidian thing is broken! Oh my god, you guys! I need to head back, I need to head back! I'm almost dead! Uh, I can't see, I can't see! I was wondering, like, how'd I get overrun, but... It's not because I was bad, it's just because my, my, my obsidian cleaver... Oh my god, skeleton! He's gonna get over here. You guys, I need to go by the mouth. Oh my god! Half of a heart! Half of a heart! Jeez! How did I survive that? That is pure luck! Holy! Holy! Okay, okay. We're, we're slowly regenerating right now. That's good. <laughs> but jeez, we need to repair our thing. I think it's obsidian, right? Yep. Obsidian right there. We sure have a lot of levels, right? Oh, 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 yeah, we died. We probably lost a pretty good amount. Oh, yeah, we don't need levels for this, don't we? Uh, just obsidian, I believe. And ba-boom. Jeez, that takes a lot of obsidian to repair. Six obsidian right there. And there you go. Man, that took like eight obsidian. But it does do an insane amount of damage. Can't really complain, honestly. All right, let's head back. Man, I didn't realize that. I heard, uh, I heard, I, I remember hearing, like, the breaking sound. I thought, like, it was a different sound. I, I, I guess I didn't. Like cor correlate the two towns together, the broken sword town and the obsidian cleaver actually being legitimately broken. Oh my god, this guy's going to kill me, isn't he? Oh man, yeah, because we have like no health right now. Oof, there we go. All right, let's head back. Can we even make it back right now? I don't even know. <laughs> I think we're going to die. We need to. Oh, god. How how far do I need to be from that thing to not get shocked? Gee, I think I'm going to. Oh my god. Am I going to- Okay, well, there we go, we got him. These things are basically one or two shots, so- Oh my god, he's going to be- Okay, we got him right there. Man, we need to close that door, like, right now. I want to kill these dumb crap fellows. Oh, no, 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 Oh my god, where is it? Oh, there it is right there. Whew, we got it. Okay, we need to be real careful right now. Oh, let's get rid of that embarrassing death point. 
There you go. Get rid of that piece of- oh, whoops. Get rid of that piece of trash. <laughs> Alright. Well, let's, uh, I suppose we can get rid of this right here. Place a thing. No, 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 no. Okay. Whew. Uh, oh yeah, I guess because of this- that thing right there, it doesn't really, like, give us an advantage to, like, slit things, so I guess we can place one right here, that'd be fine. Oh, no, 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 until we get attacked like that! Jeez! Oh, no, 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 oh, Venomous Elder Scrap, you kidding me? Gee! Okay. Man, we're having so much trouble over there. We're losing all these, like, uh, not even experience points, really. The, uh... What's it called? Those... Mission Outlook. Jeez, those points. <laughs> you can tell it's been a little while since I played. Anyways, let's go back. This episode's getting pretty long. I'm gonna have to end it here pretty soon. Man, I... I, I, do, I don't really want to end the episode before I place down the golems, you know? Because we worked pretty much this whole entire episode on getting the golem fellows in. Oh my god. Venomous, venomous little fellow. Let's get this... Oh, there you go. Whew, got him. Okay, there we go. Uh, okay, that, that does open up a little bit of a slit. I guess we can just kill these guys real quick, make sure there's no... Hello! Never gonna be able to kill us. So there you go. Alright, got him. Okay. Let's break. Oh, god, there's one right there. Dumb little nasty things. Piece of the trash. Okay, whew. I wonder how that guy got me. Was that another? Oh, yep, mold out just crab. Okay. Whew. Man, this is crazy. I I don't know if our golem fellows are gonna be able to survive this. Honestly, though, you know? Man! One of them's gonna have their work so entirely cut out for them. <gasps> Anyways, I'm gonna need to place down the chest here, so. Place down the chest, come on, I guess we can place them down, like, uh, there and there. Oh, whoops. There we go. Double chest right there. I think one of the golems should be able to hopefully access that from that block. Ooh, there's a red heart container right there. Perfect. Alright, he's basically, like, right next to a vent, too. Can I break that? I guess I could, right? Can I break that? Oh, oh, okay, that goes into another dimension. <laughs> Don't want that to happen. Uh, let's get, uh... Oh, whoa, no, 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 I just placed down the golem. Oh, we can open up doors! Oh, that's cool! Is that the, the one that... Come on, come on, come on, what? He's going to... Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, he's killing, he's killing. He's, he's doing his job. We need to go place down the other golems here. You guys, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. That's the gather, yeah, guard and guard. Come on, come on. Come on, place down the other golems. Here we go. Kill these dumb pieces of trash. Oh, no, 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 come on, let me place down the other golems! There you go. Oof. Now let me get the golem, gather the golem. Right. There, there you go. Oof. Come on, please tell me the golems are not going to die. There you go, we got them. Gather the golem, we're getting them. Hopefully you're doing a pretty good job killing them. Is there one? Oh, slain by, okay, I thought, whew, I thought one of my golems just died right there. Grim, okay, Grim Eldritch, man, I keep getting these things in the chat and I'm like over here worried and stuff, you know? Man, okay, come on, come on, kill them! Do your job, you guys. Jeez. Kill these pieces of trash. Are you, are you picking anything up? Okay, yeah, he is picking stuff up. Just very slowly. Or pretty much, like, not at all, really. I'm not seeing... Are the other golems dead? Are they dead? Are they dead? Don't tell me they're dead. Okay, let's go inside there. I don't need to go inside there, you guys. Where are they? You guys, I don't... I don't even see them. Oh my god! What happened to them, though? They're like gone, they're like dead, where are they? I don't see them at all! Oh, whoa, 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 there's like a baby crab thing. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Jeez. Man! Okay, okay. I think, I don't think we can... Oh, no! That's terrible. Um, Omelisk Island, let's head back. Uh, we might need to get, uh, let's get our Golden Master's bell. Oh, man, don't tell me that they don't... That they don't, like, drop and stuff whenever they die. Please tell me that they're, like, inside of that chest that the golem fellow picked up his dead brethren. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. There it is right there. Oh, my God. There's, like, a baby one right there. Oh, tainted. That's a tainted... That's weird. That's a tainted thing, but whatever. Let's kill this, uh... Let's get this golem. Come on, pick him up. Come on, pick him up. Pick him up. Pick him up. Get over here. Okay. Oof. We got him. I don't know where the other golems are, though. Just as Eldritch Crab. Are they up there? Is that a... I don't see him up there. I don't know where he is. Man! I'd hate to see that they're gone and dead and stuff already, you know? Okay, let's kill that dumb Eldritch Crab. God, there's just so many of these. I might just have to come over here manually and just kill these guys, but man, we might have some casual... Oh, wait! Oh, wait, that was the gathering one that I got right there. Okay, there we go. Jeez! Is that really one over there? Done... Okay, it doesn't look like it. Yeah, it's another port right there. 
There's none inside there, man. I think they're gone forever, just like Shayla, you guys. Ah, well, I guess I'm going to have to end the episode right here. Kind of upset about that, I guess they're gone forever. So, anyways, we're getting a lot of enderpearls over here, I can't complain, but thank you guys are very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button up. But my latest videos on YouTube on page as soon as they come out so you don't miss an episode. But until then, thank you guys are very much for watching, and I'll see you guys here next time with some more Brightfall. May all the fallen golem brethren rest in peace. Ren and my Oh, undying Eldritch Crab, really? Is that thing, like, not able to die? <laughs> Jesus crazy. Anyways, I'll see you guys here next time. Oh, whoops. I'll see you guys here next time. Oh, bye there.